Holy shit! Look at that! Boys are on. Here we go. You may be wondering why are you putting $1,427 worth of diesel in this massive boat? And the reason why is the three of us, we're taking this thing from here on the Gold Coast all the way up to Fraser Island. We're gonna fish our way. This is home for the next like three or four days. We're getting there. Just put our first lines in the water here. We're off double olive point. Razor, yes. just there. We whacked in these new shallower diving DTXs. Yeah, that's you, bro. That's your side. Oh, we got a double. Yeah. You're kidding. Double bending. Oh, my God. What have we got here? The world's cutest long tails. I'm going to get you. Oh, my God. A bit of product testing. Very tiny, longy, but that. What is that, Jack? It's a new, new it's like a GTX. shallower diving yeah. DTX, eh? Hey? It's a smaller size, 145. There you go. It's in the water for like what? Oh, 10 what? seconds? Yeah, did you ever get it to strike? Not bad. Alrighty, here we go, boys and girls. We're about to cross this bar into the southern end of um, Fraser, I guess. What, what, what is this, Inskip Point? We don't know exactly where the entrance is, so we're just going up and down having a look for a channel and a clear path, but it looks pretty psycho. That's psycho. Look at that. We made it, boys. Little touch and go there, a little bit of a puckering of the ring piece, but we're through. Refueling again, another 1600 litres going in. Very expensive. We've got local grommets here. What's your name, man? Atty. Atty. Nice to meet Jayden. you. Jaden. Jaden. The boys have come down to say good day. They got, I gave them a little prezzy. Thank you. A little vibe each. Just catch lots of fish. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Uh, I don't think it gets any better, right? Wow. The plan today, we're gonna to go outside, eastern side of the bar, and um, maybe catch a blue marlin, maybe catch a few black marlin, who knows. But all we're gonna do is try and catch something. That's all we need to round the trip off. Too light. Too light. It's one of the pretty cool things of this trip that I was keen to do is learn a bit of shit from these guys about marlin fishing because I have no idea whatsoever. So there's obviously a lot that goes into it. That's testing drag pressure so you can get the gigantic hook into a blue marlin's face. What's the pressure you want? Uh, depending on line class and what we're doing and what hooks we're using, but... Um, I think it's like a third, basically a third of the breaking strength, so like, like 8 kilo on 24 or 12 kilo on 27. Yeah. Try and, like, depends on what the bite's like, there's 8 there now, so that'd be on 24. Yeah. Look at that, we just got hit by blue on the teaser. 
Holy shit. <laughs> it's like it, he's hacked sort of. You can pull the leader off. Very on edge here, the brook. We've had three marlin bites now in what, like half an hour. I'm just tripping out, waiting for the boys to start yelling at me. And um, then we'll go from there. But I'm feeling like right now it might happen. I haven't even cracked a beer yet. the blood pumping the old marlin, doesn't it? Whew. Oh, wow. 
car, bro. Okay, I've got him. You alright? I don't know if you're alright. Let go, let go, let go. Tag in. Holy shit, man, I'm shaking like crazy. That's really fucking crazy, man. What do you reckon? Well done, mate. Thanks, mate. That was mental. I can't believe that. So good. How cool is that? Wow. So we've earned ourselves a stubby right That's there. the shark karma we were talking about. Yeah. That was sick. Fuck. That's really something wild that I've never really copped like that before. <laughs> Fucking hell. And that was a build up. Like we had those fish. We had them like, eating at the back of the boat, but they just didn't want to play. And then that guy just committed and came back and back. And, and then there's some lunatic upstairs yelling at you to whine. I was like trying to turn the handle and nothing would move. That's epic. I see why people love it. Sip of your beer. Oh, never you want a sip, do you? You haven't even cracked it yet. Just about to put my tomato sauce on the roll. I think he's coming up a little. You're right. Yeah. All good. How many blue marlin have you caught before? Because you're relatively calm here, aren't you? Yeah, I don't know. I think he's just happy. I'm stoked. Oh, God. I gotta say, in the conditions. This man right here has been the most positive person I've ever met. We've been through the doldrums the last couple of days. Well, that smiles there. Yeah. Not gonna lie, Brooksy, very scared about this possible leader grab. All right, we're doing leader practice here, Brooks. Boys teaching me. One. Two, hold like crazy, wanna let go, boom. Hold, hold. Kinda psyched for it, but I'm also shitting myself. Talk me through it. Any any pressure on the spine yet? Yeah, my gluteus maximus. It's a bit twitchy. <laughs> Full stale, mate, eh? Yeah, he's just sitting under. Okay, catch that later, catch that later. Oh, fish. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
I got you, I got you. No way. Yeah. I can't believe how stubborn he is. Yeah. He's a big fish, brah. Yeah. He... I'm trying. That's it, perfect. Hold on, hold on. Just move back. Get another rat. I'm trying, bruh. Okay, Curry, you're ready now. Holy fuck, man. Big one. What do I do? You gotta play it up. Try and go to the side. Go to the side. Just keep pointing. Point to your way. Pressure. Holy fuck! Come on, get his nose up! One sec. Okay, boys, we're gonna get him up, we won't come to the side. Side, get him right. That's it, that's it, keep him up there, keep walking. That's it. Okay, grab his nose! That's it. Keep free, guys. Here go. You want me to grab his nose? You grab his nose, Brendan, get out of the right. Grab it. Got him! That's it, that's it, that's it. Holy look at this, shit. Look at, this. look at this, two hands. Yes! That hook, yes. just don't fall out, just push the hook. Push the hook. It, it, Barb's not even in. You amazing creature, man. Oh my god, bro. Hey, do you want to grab him? I'll take a shot of you. You're a fish, bro. Here we go. Swim, buddy. There we go. See all these? I wonder where there's any squid fishes in there. Alrighty, end of the day. We're catching sea snakes with the net off the back. Couple of beers, and look at this, we got fresh long tail sashimi. Fresh cobia caught off a shark on the shelf. That was large. That was large. The boys are living here. I think she's going to get a little windy tomorrow, so this is going to be probably our last hurrah for the trip. I'm pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Today was amazing. Yeah. Done well. Yeah. Really good. Just before we go here, yeah, I just want to show you something. Brooksy's just gone out and got himself another capture for the trip. It's a sea snake in the bait net. Look at that baby sea snake. They're everywhere around the boat. Look at that little thing. Get him back. That's pretty cool. Oh, go on. Out of there. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you check out, obviously, this trip. We've been, um, we're on the Nomad boat, so jump over, check out the new flying fish. There's also these new DTXs that we've been using, smaller, 145, and they're like a shallower diving DTX. So this color here, as you can see, has been um, getting nibbed quite a bit. So jump over, check them out, you can get them in all your tackle stores all over the bloody world these days. So get around them, they're helping the boys out, we'll help them out. Cheers.